enemy I'm gonna make it to the top, leave a legacy If I got something to say, you better let me speak Turn it up a new degree, bitch, you ain't seen anything I pop off with the new Wise up a little Some of the OK people are getting roped into a campaign against me And the problem is, you are OK people and I don't wanna hurt you too you don't know what this is about, so listen, no matter how hard and cringe it may be, there has been an effort to pressure me. I have seen the names. Mainly the same group of people from one area of the game, and we know them to not be cool gamers, they are only liked by their own little group. Just a small group, but I'm a small channel so it's easy for them to come along and look bigger than they are. They never pick on anyone bigger than them. Typical, I have had to hide some from the channel now as it's got very personal and nasty, for their own protection too, they do not know what they do, they have become obsessed and driven, and now they are harming their own reputations and accounts, this is beyond what I think is okay. Because they can't comment on an adult level, some of the comments are auto-blocked by YouTube systems, so are against terms of service, so what was this all about? I'm a content creator, I was always gonna get hassle. Anyone with some form of intelligence knows this happens. This is why we don't see content creators going to be A1, well at least not every day like I did. You just can't do it, people want a piece of you. You either simp to the cool kids or they will stomp their feet for some attention, after a year of trying to make this work, it got too much. I felt let down by my current guild who I assumed would be more supportive. To be fair they aren't all bad. It was a small group that had taken issue with me, thought it was okay to hassle me for hours. Kids be kids, most of that guilt have gotten over this incident and we have all moved on. Have even chatted about it, but it was when it turned creepy and weird and no one had the courage to call it out, well that's when it was too much and I called it a day. Any of you would have, if you were reasonable. What do I mean creepy and weird, so many people were hassling me, as a content creator. I was the most fun to torment. It was known I was trying really hard to be more chill and complain less. As some from my guild had said I complain a lot. Fair enough, I took that on board, I listened to the feedback, seems they didn't like that I listened, what they really wanted was me to be unreasonable so they had something to fight, they were gonna try and make me snap. Even making comment in the guild chat about people bringing drama to BA. Well at that time I wasn't. I was silent and standing there, ignoring hours of being bombarded. They found it frustrating that I did not react, this was my own guild mates, just some of them. Cause let's be real, they loved my complaining, it gave them something to hate and gather around, and I had taken that way from them, when it got too much I went to safe zone and things got creepy, beyond okay, beyond what most would call agreeable. Sure it wasn't my guild mates being creepy, but they stood by and said nothing. Not cool, I was having simulated sexual action preformed to my shy character. Her man no one was calling it out, in fact, as you may have seen if you watched the video, some were happy to praise it, that the thing is. You have been asked to come along and bash the snoods, but you haven't looked into what this is all about. You're just following the group mentality. Even some of the more respectable gamers, roped in by their so-called mates, okay. You join their hate train but it will come back on you. You are supporting a person that did weird stuff to a shying game, recorded and can be called up on at any time. That's the boat you're in. And it's not just me saying it happened, video is there and uploaded, that's what you are supporting. Did they not tell you this? Nah, they just said, come and hassle this complaining and cringe shy player. And you jumped at the chance. So if you are okay with this, sure carry on. But now we know what you're into. Me? Sorry, not my thing, and that's why I left and called it out. Like a normal person, so you are showing you agreed and are into such weird things? This hate group, seeing blood in the water. Getting what they say they wanted. Me gone, out the way? Well, they missed me. I was their content. As soon as they knew I had left, they came running to my channel to carry on the attack. If I meant nothing to them. Surely they would have got on with their own things, so carry on if you with, but I've pointed out, yet again, what you're supporting, what you're showing you think is acceptable. 
This is me helping you avoid damage to your reputation. This is a message to the more mature gamer out there. Don't let them take you down with them. Feels good to hate someone as a group. Bonds you, makes you feel safe and connected. It's human nature, mob mentality. But the thing you're bonding over. EU, some of the attacks have ranged from sexist to mental health comments. Although I have never exposed my gender nor will I because some are very judgmental either way. Sad to see some are like this, but when you have no argument, you go for the simplest attacks, let's look at the mental illness comments. Let's say I am, so then you come and torment me when you believe I may be struggling mentally. Isn't that kinda low, should you not just ignore me? Would you not pity me if you believe what you say? You're the sort of gamer that pretends to be cool, but here you are showing us who you really are when you get a little upset. When your ego is hurt, or think you can gain favor with your so-called pals. Kind sad that you can't separate a character from the player? Maybe the game is your reality. Maybe it's all you have, you failed in the game, you failed in role play and pretend it's cringe, yet do it all the time. Ham, your cringe comments. I like being cringe. Always have an always stated I'm um, why? Cause it grinds your gears. Cringe. Kinda cool, ain't it? But I called it out to one, bait you in and two, because there are people out there that don't like being called cringe, they aren't like me. Wow. That video cut deep didn't it? It really triggered some of you, played, so now it gets personal. You wanna hurt the player behind the character. Ha, huh, issues, none of the comments will change what I do or make me go away, but I find it so sad that such gamers exist. And that they are at the top of part of our PvP scene, a small part yeah, always will be. But most gamers are not like these creeps. They aren't the best, we know who the best are, and they are all-round good people, as they are filled with self-confidence and don't need to participate in such things. But I get why there is such a negative image of PvP, because the group I'm dealing with now, they like to involve themselves in other people's business. They don't stick to node war or open world PvP. Nah, they are there in BA, or a forum and in channels, attacking and bitching, some of you have assumed, as a PvP player, that I may be like this. Nah, I'm not one of them, else I would not be under attack. Remember that, these toxic players, they have got all their gear and they still struggle. And to get been by a shy, even if it's one out of ten fights. Ouch, it hurts their ego so much they become obsessed. A shy, who is not even that into gear. Has publicly shown what I'm rocking, and I have limited ability in PvP, far from the best. Yet, they lose to this. And in front of their mates in BA, these are the real toxic gamers. Sadly some bored and egotistical players live in BA1, near hard capped and have nothing left to do in the game, yet too afraid to go to RBF or AOS, so upset that one show was showing them up. Let them have BA1, but I have a feeling, if I go to the effort of moving my work somewhere else, they will come looking, because they need me, they want me, just as we have seen them come to my channel, I will remember the names of them that have been brave. They are the sort of people that don't care what others think and are their own people. Real gamers, what has all this achieved? It's exposed who the trash are. It has given me the go-ahead to clip and record them dying to a shy when I see them. No longer will I ask when it come to such players. But will I see them outside the safety of BA and their group, the creep that preformed simulated sexual action on me? As show in video, well he's nowhere to been seen but he sent his mate out. How do I know, cause he spawn killed me when I had no pots and said it was for that player. Wow, you are openly supporting that creepy a-hole, that's what you're into, I had to respawn town to get pots, went back and on the way. So this player on the road, I jump off my horse and so did they, a fully geared hash, seasonal, vs a shy with no guild buffs and still getting gear. Well I had pots now, and I got them down to 10% health, before I died, they ran after that. All that human damage you had yeah. I guess human damage isn't that good. You know it's getting clipped next time. Right? But I haven't seen them since, so this hate train, it's allowed me to collect and remove such people from my channel, before we move on to more important stuff.
Leaving BA, kinda knew it could happen, always had planned and have been working on stuff from the moment the issues happened, I haven't been sitting here all worried about these creeps, I have been progressing, planning and getting ready for the next year's content and plans are big. The prep work needs to start now, these creeps. They have labeled themselves, they will be part of coming content, for this I thank them, my videos, well they will eat away at them, because once all this dies down. Once you and I have lost interest. They will know this is all still here, showing who and what they are, we are ready to move on and have fun. But they are stewing in their own bile, still hoping to break me. But I've already won. You gave me all I need. I'm taking shots at the enemy. I'm gonna make it to the top, leave a legacy. If I got something to say, you better let me speak. Turn it up a new degree, bitch, you ain't seen anything. I pop off with